Hey guys, I am back with my super easy, simple, quick Walgreens deals this week. Um, super, super great because if you're not an insert clipper and you don't collect inserts or you don't get the Sunday papers and do the actual insert coupons, there are some deals still out there with printable coupons and these are the deals that you want to stock up on this week. Um, awesome. We got two great printable coupons. We've got um, new printable coupons on Colgate Toothpaste, which just came out today, Sunday the 26th. And then we have a printable coupon on Colgate Pro Health Mouthwash. And there are some awesome register reward deals at Walgreens, valid through July 2nd, and they just started today. So I did two transactions and I'm gonna break them down to you to show you how you can roll your register reward from transaction one into your second transaction to help save a little bit of out-of-pocket money. But um, these are deals that you can do over and over again if you'd like, you can totally stock up. Um, and again, they're valid through the 2nd of July, so you have time to go ahead and do them as well. So the first deal is on the Colgate Total um, toothpaste, and this is the six ounce um, size. They're on sale at Walgreens through the second, two for five dollars. And when you buy two, you earn a three dollar register reward, which you can use on your for, your future purchase. So that's what I did. I just rolled it into the second transaction. Um, if you're new to couponing at Walgreens, Walgreens is a little tricky. So you can't stock up and buy a ton of these and it will only print one register reward. So if you get four Colgate toothpaste and try and double up the deal, it will only print out one. So for each deal that you do, you have to do them separately in order to get that register reward. And also too, you can't buy the Colgate toothpaste, get the register reward and use it on two Colgate toothpaste. You can't use a register reward on the same item that you're purchasing that produces a register reward, if that makes sense. So buy two of them, they're two for five. We have awesome printable dollar off one coupons, which are linked below. So you can get your coupons, print those out, print out two of them. Um, after the printable coupons, you pay $3, but you get back a $3 uh, register reward. So it ends up the toothpaste is completely free. So then I took my $3 register reward and I rolled it into transaction number two. For transaction number two, I purchased three of the Crest Pro Health mouthwashes. Be careful guys, it's not the Pro Health Advanced, it's just the Pro Health. And this size is the 16.9 uh, ounce size. They're $2.99 this week. And when you buy three of them, you get a $5 register reward. So, and we have dollar off one coupons available. And again, those are printable coupons. So you need to go ahead and print three of those out to use one coupon for each of the mouthwashes. Now, in order to use that register reward from transaction number one, I needed to find a filler item that doesn't have a coupon so I could use that register reward coupon toward it because per transaction at Walgreens, if you have four items, you can only use four coupons um, in order to use it. You have to have one, you, you would have to, the most you have is one coupon for each. But um, register rewards are kind of considered coupons. So if you're using them, it has to be, um, you can't just get three of these use three of the dollar off one printables and the register reward because the computer is going to say there's not enough items in this purchase to use all of these coupons so it won't take your register reward item. So a filler item is a super cheap item. It could be this week some great filler items are Jello pudding and Jello gelatin are on sale two for a dollar with in-ad coupons. So that's what I did. I purchased one of the chocolate puddings for 50 cents and I did use that in ad coupon so don't forget to use that as well. But I know that they have Arizona teas on sale too for a dollar so um, iced tea is a good filler item but something that's usually pretty cheap where you can use that register reward. Um, as school back to school comes into play there's going to be pencils and super cheap stationary items that will make awesome filler items. So. 
I had the three coupons, one from each of the crest, and then the register reward from transaction number one, which is considered a coupon. So I used that to supplement this item. So four items, four coupons, we're good to go. So um, what it ends up being is you end up paying after using three of the coupons and your in-ad coupon for the Jello. It comes to $6.47 out of pocket, and that's with using your register reward of $3 as well. So after all of those coupons, you pay $6.47, but you get back a $5 register reward. So it makes all of your items only $1.47. So that's like 25 cents per item, I think. So super great deal. Now remember, the Colgate was you paid $3, you got a $3 register reward. That was a total wash. So when you rolled over your register reward into transaction two, you had to pay out of pocket $6.47 after all your coupons and your register reward. But you're gonna get back a $5 register reward, compliments of P&G that you can use um, on any other thing you need to purchase at Walgreens this week, or you can hold on to them they're usually good for like a week and a half or two weeks. So this one will expire on the 10th of July. So you can um, roll it over like you do at Target with gift cards or CVS with ECBs and use it for next week um, on any transactions that they may have. Or you can use it on grocery items that you need for the week, whatever you need. So that are those are the Walgreens deals to get. If you're not a coupon clipper, but you like principal coupons, these are some deals that I really want you guys to stock up on. Um, these are personal care items that pantries and churches and shelters are looking for donations. So it's super awesome to stock up not only for your family and your friends, or you can give them to your neighbors, but um, for others to donate as well. So thanks for watching guys. I hope it wasn't too confusing. Walgreens is super confusing. Um, but once you get the, the hang of it, um, I never do big transactions at Walgreens because they never go the way I plan. But when there's super easy deals like these, I love Walgreens because um, this transaction went super, these two transactions went super smooth. So thanks so much for watching, guys. Stock up. Take care. Bye-bye.